workout. So what I want you to do is reach up tall, hinge forward, walk it out, find your plank, walk it right back in and stand up. And then keep going. Walk it out, find the plank, walk it right back in and stand up. Why is this a good place to start? Nice stretch in your hamstrings. We have 10 seconds left here. And then we're gonna stand up and jog in place in five. So finish up where you are. Four, three, two, stand up, jog in place. Roll your shoulders back. Now you can stay right here. I know we're just warming up the body or you can bring those knees up. You got a 15 second push, knees up, knees up. Chest tall, belly in. Shoulders are back. In 10 seconds, we will squat right and left. Five, four, three, two, legs squat. Right, center, left. 30 seconds there. There we go, 30 seconds. Right, center, left, you got it. So on Fridays, I tend to put it all together. I got cardio, I got strength, I got core. You have 15 seconds. Keep squatting. Side to side, 10 to go. In five seconds, you hold your squat. Three, two, hold your squat. Put your hands on the floor. Straighten your legs. Bend your knees. Bring your arms up. Stand up. Do it again. Bend your knees, hands to the ground. Straighten, bend, arms up, stand up. We have two more. Bend, straighten, bend, drive it up. Let's do one more. Bend, straighten, bend, arms up, stand up, jack it out. Jack it out, we got 30 seconds. Everything we do today will be 30 seconds. Keep jacking. I think I'm gonna have to go with the braid with my mane. Keep moving. So if you're low impact, you're tap and tap. What do we got? We got 15 seconds left. On deck is our world's greatest stretch in 10. You know the drill. Three, two, let's go. Reach up, hinge forward, walk it out. Right foot, right hand. Right hand down, right foot back. Now if you prefer to stay there, just switch to the left. If you like the walk out, walk in, do that. You have 30 seconds left, plenty of time. One of the most important things you can do is check in with how you feel today, right? Only you know what you did yesterday. You got it, you have 15 seconds. Keep moving. Keep moving, less than 10. When we stand up in five seconds, Reverse lunge, left leg forward, three, two. So everybody stand up, left leg forward, right leg back. Left leg forward, right leg back. Yeah. Up, uh, yeah, go. Yeah. Okay. All good. So, reverse lunge chat. You got it. Ready, hold it low, hold it low. Ready, power knees, go, pull, pull, pull. You got 20 seconds there. Spine is long, belly in. Chest is open, 15 seconds. Pull, pull, 10 to go. We jog it out in five. Four, three, two, jog it out, shake it out. Don't worry, I did not forget about the other side. Roll your shoulders back. Ready, go, right leg forward, left leg back. Lunge and tap, lunge and tap. Take your time, drop your back knee down. There we go, you got it, Ruth. 10 seconds here, then we hold it down. I am telling you right now, you will see this exercise again. Three, two, hold it low. Hinge forward, arms up, let's go. Pull and pull. Come on, 
We got 15 seconds. Press into your right heel. 10 to go. Can you get lower? You jog it out in four, in three, two, jog it out, shake it out. Now, I'm gonna ask you for that high knee run one more time. Ready, go, 15 seconds. There you go. In 10 seconds, high plank. If you prefer an elbow plank, go for it. Four, three, two, hit the deck. High plank or elbow plank. Now, first 10 seconds, I just want you to breathe. Breathe in through your nose, roll your shoulders back, out through your mouth. Then give me toe taps. Right, left, right, left. You feel awesome? Jacket. 15 seconds. There we go. 10 to go. You got five seconds, you hold that plank. Four, three, Two, hold the plank. Walk your hands into your feet and show me that hustle. Quick feet, quick feet. You know the drill, when I say touch, you touch, touch, touch. When I say up, you go up, up, touch. When I say direction, quick turn back to the middle. Right, left, touch. Keep going, you got 20 seconds. I do this to bring your mind and your body together, touch. Touch, up, left, right. Now I'm telling you you have 10 seconds left. I'm asking you to go lower and faster. Touch, 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 up, break, shake it out, shake it out. So, first exercise, single weight. My booty comes down, my heels are in, my toes are out ever so slightly. A figure eight, it's only 30 seconds. One, two, three, four. I pick it up, I press it. So everybody meet me here. I have 30 seconds on my clock. Three, come down. Two, you're ready, Ruth, let's go. Figure eight, one, two, three, four. Then zip up your legs, press it up. Keep moving. Four figure eights, one press. Now, our second exercise is a cardio exercise, and you get to put your weight down in eight seconds. Track your knees out, punch your belly in. We'll do the first one together in three, in two. I'm gonna press one more time, weight comes down. Now everybody pivot to your left. So your left leg is forward, right leg is back, but bent. Imagine you still have that weight in your hands. Bring the weight up and over, up and over. Go, 30 seconds. So you're moving as quickly as you can up and over. Bending your back knee, engaging your belly, pushing your body, there you go. When we come back to this exercise for a second set, if you want to bring your weight, you are welcome to. You have eight seconds. Come on, you got it, yes. I love it, Jen. In four, we plank. Three, two, find that high plank. High plank position. Now, take your right hand, tap your left shoulder. Take your right hand, tap the floor, open it up, reset. Left hand right, left hand floor, left hand up. 30 seconds to reset your breath. Open it up. Make sure your feet rotate with your body. We got 10 to go. Shoulder tap, floor, sky. Five seconds. Let's do one more on each side. One more. Bonus. And stand up. Grab your weight. Figure eight. Four, three, two, go. So we're back to the top. One, two, three, and four. And stand up, big press. Drop it again. Now at the end of your fourth pass through, you should be ready to zip up your inner thighs and stand up. That's my little gift to you. When we come to our rainbow lunge in eight seconds, you are welcome to bring this weight with you. 
I'm not going to. You do you. Three, two, so now my weight goes down. I go up and over, up and over. Let's go, 30 seconds. There we go, you got it, side to side. Yes, Shannon. Beautiful, you all look great. Hips should rotate. They should face the right, they should face the left. Team, you have 10 seconds left here. You can make your arms as big or as small as you want to. You have five seconds. Ready for that plank? Three, two, hit the deck. If plank is not your jam, you can come down to your back for a bicycle. Same shoulder tap, T-spine, go. Shoulder tap, floor, T-spine. If you prefer an elbow plank, right hand to left, left hand to right, rotate. I think it's a great opening in the chest and in the shoulders, the T-spine. It's also strengthening your side body, your obliques. You still have seven seconds left. And the third set is always the best set. Three, two. So now pop your legs up, grab your weight, chest is tall. Let's go, 30 seconds. I love it, you don't like it, you love it. Keep moving, chest is tall. Now, look at what's happening with your knees. Are they buckling in? If the answer to that is yes, drive them out. You should feel your outer thighs, outer glutes activate. You have 10 seconds. Can you get lower? I know you can, will you? You have five seconds. Rainbow lunge. In three, two, weight is down side to side. Right into it, team, 30 seconds. Feel the rib connect with your hip every time you pivot. And I'm telling you, you have 15 seconds left. I'm telling you, you are gonna finish up block one momentarily. So can you move a little bit faster? Come on, you got seven seconds. That high plank's gonna feel awesome in three, in two, hit the deck. Find the plank. Now, once you're in the quality position, then you add the movement. Shoulder tap, floor, T-spine. Shoulder tap, floor, T-spine. Same 30 seconds here. So the first block that we are wrapping up had three exercises. You still have 10 seconds left here. I will give you a quick chance to grab water in five, in three, two, and break. So everybody grab water, I'm gonna grab water. Now, on deck, I always have two options for this next exercise. First option, I have one weight under each hand, high plank for a renegade row, alternating sides. If that's too much on your wrist, stagger your stance, right arm, left arm. So that's your next first exercise. Second exercise is cardio, no weights. So everybody come down into your starting position, either in your plank or standing. Left leg forward, three, two, let's go. Right, left. Now, I happen to be on a wood floor here. Think about how softly you can put the weight down, right? How quietly. If you are in the renegade row, you got it, Shannon. Now, if you're standing, your left leg stays forward the whole time. In five seconds, you will put your weights down. Everybody will stand up. Three, two, so weights down, everybody up. Meet me in a squat. When I say go, you squat center, you squat right. Not a jumper, don't jump. Go, center, right, center, right. Yes, you are only going to the right. You have 15 seconds. Because each block contains a strength, a cardio, and a core, in eight seconds, you come back to the renegade row. That's core. Three, two, hit the deck. Find the plank. If you are in the standing position, other leg forward, go, 30 seconds. Pull, pull, 
Renegade row. Feet out wide. Chest is open. Hips are quiet. Elbow drives back. You got it. You look great. Yes. Looked great, Maria. You have 10 seconds. Now, you know we went center right last time, so of course we're going to go center left. Three, two, everybody up. Drop your booty, hands on the ground. Ready, go. Center, left, center, left. We got 30 seconds. <sighs> Only two exercises this block. Yes. I love watching your heads fly. You got it, Emery. Come on, we're 15 seconds down. 15 seconds to go. Yes, you can. Yes, you will. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Come on, get a little breathless. Own that power in your body. You have three, two, hit the deck. Last one. Find the position. Now, if you are standing, I will tell you when to switch legs. Go. 30 seconds. You got it, team. How quietly, how softly can you place that weight on the ground? Standing friends, switch legs. Same move. Renegade row, you're alter alternating. Check it out. In five seconds, weight stay on the ground. Three, two, everybody up. Center, right, center, left. Go. Center, right, center, left. 30 seconds. Now on the other side of this, you're going to earn a full 45 second recovery. I'm going to see you earn it. There you go. Come on, you're already halfway there. Yes. I love that power, Ruth. Reaching for the ceiling. Eight seconds. Four. Come on, three more. Yes, two. And break. Shake it out. You get 45 whole seconds to breathe. Now, we pick up our weights for our next block. We go back to three exercises. First exercise we did in the warm up. Now we have load. So I have weights in my hand, left leg forward, right leg back. We will start here and then we will add on to that. You still have 20 ginormous seconds to do whatever you need to do. But I want you to start grabbing your weights, standing up tall, shaking out your legs, getting ready. So in eight seconds, I say go. Left leg forward, right leg goes back. I know you're ready. Three, two, let's go. Left leg forward, right leg back. You got it. First 15 seconds here. Eyes are up, chest is open. On your next one, hold it, hold it. Now go down for two and up for two. Down for two, up for two. In eight seconds, we put our weights down. You know that power knee from the warm up. Last three, last two, weights go down, hinge forward, pull, pull right into it, team. Come on, we got 30 seconds here. 30 seconds, yes you can. 30 seconds, yes you will. <sighs> Press into the heel, drop the booty down. Appreciate the power of your body. Eight seconds. I'm gonna give you a little gift in five. You're gonna lay down on your back in three. Two, big transition down on your back. Legs up towards the ceiling. Head, neck, and shoulders are up. Drop your right heel down. Pull left leg towards you. One, two, switch. One, two, switch. Pull. One, two. So head, neck, and shoulders are up. Chest is open. Appreciate the great stretch in the back of each leg. You have 15 seconds. One, two. One, two. Ten to go. Can you flex your foot? Straighten out the back of your leg. Give me two more. Last one. And break. Everybody stand up. Grab your weights. I'll give you about five seconds to grab your weights and stand up. Right leg forward, left leg back. 
Let's go. First 15. First 15, single count. You got it. Chest is tall, keep moving. Remember how good it feels to stand up? Now hold it low. Two counts down, two counts up. Two counts down, two counts up. Press into your right heel. Feel your right hamstring and right glute. Give me two more. One more. Weights go down. Hinge, pull, go, pull, pull, pull. 30 seconds, pull. Two amazing things are happening here. You are building the power in the back of your right leg. You are engaging your core. Three, added bonus, your heart rate's up. You got 10 seconds. You know it's gonna feel good at eight when you lay down on your back. Come on, you gotta take it to the end. Three, yes, Emerson. Two, and break. Down on your back. Legs are up. This time, start with your right leg. Pull, one, two. Pull, one, two. One, two. Can you get your knee towards your nose and your nose towards your knee? Now on our third set, we rock out the left and the right before we come down for that core exercise. You have eight seconds left here. There you go. Four, three, two, everybody stand up. Grab your weights. We go back to our left leg. First 15 seconds, single count. Go, lunge, tap. Now, first 15 seconds, lunge and tap. Remember how good the tap feels. Give me two more. One more. Now hold it low. Press into your heel, shoulders back. Now let's pulse it for those last 10 seconds. Pulse it. Now we will put our weights down in five. Power knees first in three, two. Weights go down, arms are up. Go, pull. Pull, pull. Make sure your knee stays over your ankle. Make sure your spine stays long. Oh, you got it. I know that you are exhaling. You are saying, come on, Jill. Count down that last 11 seconds. And I will. But first, you got to get lower. It's the last time we're going to do it. You've only got five left. We pick up our weights in three, two, shake it out. You should need to shake it out. Right leg forward, left leg back, go. Perfect. Right leg forward, left leg back. Press off of your heel. Stand tall. One more, last one. Hold it. Set it up. Ready, pulse it. 10, 9, 8, 7. Squeeze your left glute. Open up your left hip. Four, three, two, weights go down. Ready, go, pull, pull, pull. Come on, 30 seconds there. You got it. Yes, Jim P. Rocking it out, 15 seconds. Get lower. Yes, you can, 10 seconds. And how good is it gonna feel when we come to our back in five? So good in four. Three, two, on your back. You know the drill. Legs up. Doesn't matter where you start. One, two, one, two. Keep going, you got 30 seconds. Fifteen. You got it, less than 10. Four, three, two, shake it out. Now there's a very different sensation in your body when you finish with a cardio versus when you finish with a core. So 30 to 40 seconds here should reset you and get ready for what's next. You only need a single weight for our next one. Single weight for our next one. Now. We'll do our lateral lunge, keep it basic. 
Lateral lunge to the right, but then left ear to right ear. So we'll stick with the right side, left ear to right ear. So that's all you need to know to start. We got three exercises this block. Grab your weight. Shoulders back. Four, three, two, go. Lateral lunge, left ear to right ear. Lateral lunge. All ten toes are forward. Chest is tall. Reach. 15 seconds. Now, listen carefully. In 10 seconds, we switch sides. Okay, we're going to rock out both sides before we rock our cardio. And switch. So, left lateral lunge. Now, it's right ear to left ear. And what I want you to feel is the heaviness of the weight as it slips behind your head, really opening up your shoulders. You have 15 seconds, and then the weight goes down. You know moguls in eight seconds. Tailbone drives back, knees pinned together. That's where you go in three, two, weight goes down. Show me moguls, side to side, side to side, 30 seconds. So, if you're not a jumper, don't jump, but make sure your feet land together and you send your booty back together. Now, you have 10 seconds left. We come down to our butt with that single weight in five, four, three, two. Grab that weight. Come down to your butt. Weight is at your chest. Heels are down. Hinge back. Four Russian twists. Go. One, two, three, four. Weight comes to your chest. One sit up. One, two, go. Three, four. Weight is at your chest. One sit up. Keep going. Now I know that there are so many benefits from the plank, the core strengthening from a plank position. But I also know that every exercise does not have to be there. You have five seconds. Three, two. So now we bring that weight. We stand up. I'm watching you. I'll give you about five generous seconds. We start to the left. In three, two. Legs go. Lateral lunge left. Right ear to left ear. Lateral lunge. Make sure... All 10 toes are forward. Make sure your tailbone drives back. Your chest stays open. You are working on your outer glute and outer thigh. Now in five seconds, we switch sides. And switch. Now you rock it to the right. Halo. You got it. Now I want you to pay attention. I love doing one side and then the other side because you might feel where it's easier, more supportive, or less. Now you have 10 seconds. On deck, we have one, two, three moguls, one jack. One, two, three, one jack. Go, weights are down. Pop your booty back. One, two, three, one jack. One, two, three. One jab, go, 30 seconds. There we go, you got it. Legs together, looking good. Come on, halfway there. You got it. Give me power in that jack. Let that heart rate rise, team. In five short seconds, we're on the ground. Three, two, grab your weight. Meet me there, on the ground. Weight is at your chest. Then you hinge back. You find that position. Four Russian twists. Go one, two, three, four. Can you give me two sit-ups now? One sit-up, two sit-ups, then hinge back. One, two, three, four. One sit-up, two sit-ups. Keep going. You got time for two more of those. Yep. Now, if you could binge watch... Emily and Paris, while you're doing it, hinge back one more inch. 
It is good escapist entertainment. Three, two, break everybody up. Single weight in your hands. We start right, 30 seconds, let's go. Right, head low. Let's alternate sides, left. Head low, there we go, right. Head low, left, head low. There we go, right and left, you got it. Open it up, chest open, shoulders back. There are a few things kind of over the past couple of months I've become extra focused on. One is definitely core, and the other one is this. We spend so much time here, open it up. That's why I love the halo. Team, you have five seconds. Now it's three moguls, two jacks in three, two, weight goes down. So it's one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two. If you are not a mogler, if you're not a jumper, you still do not have to jump. Come on team, you got 15 seconds. I'm giving you five bonus seconds because you know you want it. 10 to go, yes Emerson. I see it, you're rocking it. Five seconds. When we come back to our Russian twist, three sit-ups, break everybody down. Weight at your chest. It pretty much never leaves there. Hinge forward. One, two, three, four, three sit-ups. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Keep moving. Keep moving, team. You have 10 seconds. There we go. Five, four, three, two, and break. Break. Now, stand up. I'm going to give you 30 seconds here. I'm going to show you the first exercise, and then I'm going to give you an option. So for the first exercise, we come back to a plank. I bring my left foot between my hands, and then I come up. My left leg stays forward. My hands come down, my left foot goes back. Then it's right foot, hands come up. So to center, high plank, left, hands come down, right. If you're dealing with the wrist and you're like, no, that's not gonna work, I want you to give me a transverse squat, right and left, okay? So those are your two options. So I'm gonna start in the high plank position. If you're meeting me there, you come down to that high plank. Let's start with our right foot between our hands in three, two, let's go. Right foot, stand up, come down, send it back. Left foot, hands come up, hands come down, bring it back. That's it. So you're working strength, opening your hips, and engaging your belly. Also working on balance. Now in eight seconds, we stand up, we tie or run. Three, two, stand up. Out, out, in, in, right leg leads. Out, out, in, in. There you go, 30 seconds. Center your weight, punch your belly into your spine. Use the arms, feel it. Feel it here. You got 15 seconds. Can you go lower? Can you go faster? In eight seconds, we go back to the top. Two exercises. Four, three, two, find the plank. Left foot, hands, hands, foot. If you need a little bit more room to move, you can have your hands on your weights but leave your weights on the floor when you stand up. <sighs> nice, deep runner's lunge. <sighs> there we go, you got it, you got 10 seconds. Yes, I love it, five seconds. Ready, stand up, left leg, out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in, 30 seconds. <sighs> Two exercises. 
That means you got a little bit. You got to give it a little bit more. Come on, you got 15 seconds. That's where I ask you to go lower and faster. 10 seconds. I see you. You look awesome. You got it, Maria. Ready for that last plank in five? I know you are. Three, two, hit the deck. Doesn't matter. Right foot, hands. Hand, foot. Left foot, hands. Hand, foot. Keep going. Stay low. Now, I will own the fact that I'm five feet tall on a good day, so it might be easier for me to stay lower. Advantage, five feet tall. 10 seconds. And I like how I say five feet on a good day. On other days, I'm 4'11 and a half. Team, you got five seconds and we're gonna stand up. Three, two, so center your weight now. We icky shuffle, one, two, three, one, two, three. Let's go, one, two, three, one, two, three. So it's on, on, off, on, on, off, but you're centered on your mat. Eyes are down, belly is in. Use the arms. There we go, you got it, 15 seconds. Yes, center, one, two, three, one, two, three. Just move your body, eight seconds. Come on, five, we're on our back in four. Right into it, in three, two, lay down on your back. Meet me in a bridge. Meet me in a bridge. No weights needed. Feet, oh, I totally just hit my head on the floor. Uh, feet flat, knees up, hips up, meet me there. Now, hands next to your hips for support. Tuck your ribs in. Draw your right leg into tabletop position. Send your right leg out, draw your right leg in, that's it. Right leg out, draw your right leg in. Now, bring your brain to your left leg. So bring your brain to your left hamstring and your left glute. And I say this all the time, I would put my hand on my hamstring and my glute on the left side to actually feel it activate. You can also take your right hand right above your hip bone to focus on the core engagement. Let's do one more. Now, put your right heel down. Now lift your hips up one more inch. When we get tired, they sag. Left knee over your left hip. Go out and in. There you go. Now I try to educate you all about your core. So I've talked about the corset, the transverse abdominis. You're still moving. So that's about an inch above your hip bones. And you should feel the movement, the engagement as you extend your legs. Now, put your left heel down. Drop your butt down, lengthen your legs, arms up. Right hand left, go. Left hand right, go. Exit up. 30 seconds. Now, if reaching your leg long is too much, bend your knee, reach for the instep. <sighs> Earlier, I asked you to keep your hands at your chest. This time, take that momentum with you. You have 10 seconds. Now on deck, we got a cross body climber. And if you're like, no, we don't, Jill, you're gonna stand up and give me a high knee run. Three, two, so flip over. I'm coming into my high plank on my weights, straightening my legs behind me, long legs, right to left, left to right, go, 30 seconds. Right to left, left to right. So do we have strength this round? Check. Do we have core this round? Check. Do we have cardio this round? Check. This is your cardio. Rotate from the hips. You have 10 seconds. There you go, you got it, Maria, just like that. Five, four, three, two, on your back. On your back, lay down on your back, feet flat, knees up, hips up. Now we're gonna add on to that. Bring your, let's do left leg to tabletop position. Left leg out, left leg in, lower right, lift right. Do it again, out, in, 
lower, lift. Out, in, lower, lift. Keep moving. So allow your heart rate to come down. Tuck your ribs in. Drive through your right heel. You have 10 seconds. And in eight seconds, we put our left heel down. There we go. Now put your left heel down, reignite, right leg tabletop. Go, out, in, lower, lift. Out, in, lower, lift. You got it. Focus totally on the glutes, the hamstrings. I have a lot of lower body love right now. You have 10 seconds. Now we move into our X setup. Let's do one more. So out, in, lower, lift, booty down, legs out, arms up. Go, 30 seconds. Right to left, left to right. You got it, team, keep moving. Remember, you can bend your knees, reach for the instep. I'm still working on the perfect way to say it. The only thing I want you to avoid is stopping. You have 10 seconds. Now in eight seconds, you already know what's coming. Cross body climbers. Three, two, flip over. Again, I bring my hands to my weight. Gives me room. Go, 30 seconds. One, two. One, two. Shoulders are square. Hips are rotating. You got it, team. Come on. We got 10 seconds. Third set's coming. Five, four. Yes, Ruth. Three, two. On your back. On your back. Quick as you can. Meet me in the bridge. I see you. Feet flat, knees up, hips up. That's where you meet me. Perfect. Now I just want you to draw your right knee in and put it down, and then draw your left knee in, put it down, march it, march it. <sighs> Pay attention, how does the, how do the muscles reactivate every time you place your heel on the ground? <sighs> are you lifting and driving from your booty and your hamstrings, or are you activating your quads? My quads love being invited to the party, I'm trying to kick him out the door. You got 10 seconds. Last set of X sit-ups. Has your name on it in four, in three. Last two, last one. Legs long, arms long. Go right into it. 30 seconds. Come on team, 30 seconds here. You got it. Keep moving. 15. Yes. Less than 10. We got five seconds. We got one more block. Four, three, two, and break. Break. Now, no weights. No weights needed for our final block. Okay. I saw everybody doing the plank shift. So now everybody gets to do that transverse squat. So I, I, I know you can't see my face, but you can see my feet. I want you to see my feet. I'm gonna take my right foot and open it up all the way out to my far right corner. Notice my left leg is straight. Then I come up, then I forward lunge. Then I forward lunge here, and I take that back toe to that corner. Forward forward, big lunge to the corner. So we're making this one a lunge. Okay, everybody stand up. Ready? Four, we start to the right. Three, two, let's go. So big lunge, forward lunge, forward lunge, other side. Forward, forward. There we go. That's it, keep moving. Your front toe should face your screen or the front every time you move. 
Now, you have 10 seconds. I did this yesterday in the cardio class and I loved it. We're gonna do it again. Three, two. Now, tap out. Typically, we have a weight on the ground. Right hand on the weight, right leg extended. So that's low. So I want one, two low, one, two high. One, two low, one, two high. Go. One, two, one, two. There you go. Yes. Just like that. Reach, reach. You all look awesome, team. You're only here for 15 more seconds. Keep moving. 10 to go. Come on, five, four, three, two, reset center. Transverse lunge, left. Forward lunge. You want more? Jump switch. Transverse right. Forward lunge. Option, jump switch. You got it, Ruth. If you're like, no, I don't want that, don't do it. That's how it works. Burpee free zone for you today, Maria. I make no promises about next Friday. Team, you got five seconds. Too low, too high. Three, two, go. Start left. Low, low, high, high. Low, low, high, high. Come on. This is that big cardio push. Getting closer and closer to that finish line. Reach, 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 reach. 10 seconds. We got one more. Last one is the best one in four, three, two. Let's do it. Reset, right foot. Stand tall, forward lunge. Option switch, left foot. Stand tall. Now, 15 seconds, keep moving. 10 seconds. You're ready for the low, low, high, high. In three, two, let's do it. Low, low, high, high. Now I'm telling you, you have 30 seconds. Keep going. Come on, come on, come on. Perfect. Low, low, you got it, Shannon. High, high. Yes, Emerson. Yes, Jen. Push it, push it. Now I'm telling you right here, right now, you have 15 seconds left. I'm asking if you can go the tiniest bit faster. Come on, in 10 seconds, I'm gonna load up that cool down song. You're gonna be ready for it in five. Yes, you can in four, three, two, and break. Break, shake it out. Shake it out, roll your shoulders back. You know, no reason to come to a dead stop. Roll your shoulders back. 48 minutes of work, I love it. Big arm circles. <sighs> Big arm circles. Bring your arms out nice and wide. Connect your hands behind you and open up your chest. So this is something really random, but it's something I want you to think about. I'm guessing most of you wake up by an al alarm clock. Do you release your hands, connect your hands in front of you, rotate your palms away. Do you wake up to like an awful alarm clock, alarm clock sound that kind of like jars you awake? Or do you wake up to some delightful music? Shake out your arms. Right ankle over your left knee. Sit down and back. I ask because this song, Awake My Soul, Mumford and Sons, is my alarm clock. And it's just got like a nice, slow, gradual build. And it gives me like a nice message to like get my brain into gear especially when it goes off at five o'clock in the morning and reset shake it out same thing on the left left ankle right knee if you need the wall for balance if not hands can come together and shake it out bring your legs out nice and wide i love this a good lateral lunge to the right and over to the left my cool down tends to be the same, keep shifting, because I assume at this point, 
Your brain is kind of like done. You don't have to think about anything complicated. Shift to the right option to pull your left toes up. And then shift to the left, pull your right toes up. So again, center your weight, hands to the floor, straighten your legs. Definitely check out my Instagram tomorrow for my Halloween costume. We all need a laugh right now, and I guarantee it will bring it. Soft bend in the knees. I had it on yesterday while I was making dinner, and both my husband and daughter walked in and were like, whoa. <laughs> oh, crazy. Take a big, beautiful, deep breath in through the nose. Inhale your great work, your great energy. And exhale. Have an awesome rest of your Friday.